All right, now we're doing free code camp, new responsive web design, build a tribute page, user stories number seven. All right, so we should see an anchor element with a corresponding ID of tribute link, which links to an outside site that contains additional information about the subject of the tribute page. And for a hint, we must give our element an attribute of target and set it to underscore blank in order for our link to open in a new tab. All right, so we're gonna make an anchor tag, an anchor element. We'll do that right here and give it a close anchor like that. Then we'll set uh, the ID to tribute link, ID, whoops, ID equals trib, whoops, string tribute hyphen link, all right? Then we're gonna give it an href of the site I'd like us to link to. You know, the old Codeman S practice videos homepage on YouTube, right? What better site <laughs> to pay tribute to <laughs> in this video? Uh, and uh, then we'll just say link right here. All right. Let's click it just to see if it does something. All right. And it works. And we're going to come down here after we open up the console, run the test. Our tribute link should have a target IS. Don't forget that. So after this, we'll say uh, target, and then we'll say equals underscore blank. All right, now let's run it. So the image element should have a display of block that looks good. So now we're on to story eight, and we'll see you next time.